Here we go. Finally shows up. All right, we're hammering it out. Recruited two run pals. Dude, this reminds me of when we first started running. Remember that, Austin? Yeah, I thought you were talking I got to me. Yeah, you too, Age. <laughs> <laughs> We got Ajax right there. Ajax is doing a, an Ironman this year. Ain't that right? Yeah, that's right, baby. It's a one-halfer. 70.3. We'll start with a half. Moro Bay. I'll probably like it, so maybe schedule a full later in the year. Yeah. And then Osti up there. He's a daddy now. He's having a kid. <laughs> no dad bots here. <laughs> Austin and I started running. This is like years ago when like Snapchat just came out. <laughs> we do like a couple miles together. And one day I, I had already gone for my run and then Austin calls me. He's like, oh, you already ran? I'm like, yeah. So Austin's like, I'm gonna go run. I'm like, all right, cool, have fun. <laughs> he comes back, he's like, yeah, I did three miles. And it took him like an hour and a half because <laughs> every hundred yards he'll stop and he was taking pictures of birds and shit. This is what you hammer right now. Come on, dude. That a boy. Hammer it out through the finish line. Arms up. That a boy. January thirteenth. What are the plans for twenty twenty four? Half Iron Man. Get back into shape. What does that? What does get back into shape look like for you? Oh, here. Let me show you a pic. You want to know what it looks like? Yeah. Get that in focus, baby. I'll be back. Did I'll be back. Right oh, hold here. on. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. What if you want to quit? Because there's going to be days you're like, you're over it. How are you going to stay? Oh, How are you going to stay disciplined? I've already had days like that. How are you going to stay disciplined, though? Uh, really don't have a choice. You can't spend 450 bucks on an Ironman. Oh, you spent. That's right. You signed up for Dude, it. It's expensive. Bro. Let's go, boy. Hammer it out. Finish strong. Oh, there you go. Hands up. Yeah. Through the finish line. Hands up. That a boy. Whoa. We got an update taking my time nursing this knee and it's feeling good today because those exercises the exercises are like really helping it i got a fresh pair of shoes right here i've used these ones once before i want to give them another another run i'm always curious i'm like i wonder if it's the shoes that could be causing knee pain you know so i think everyone raves about brooks i just did a taco talks with steph i'm like what shoes do you wear she goes brooks what are your favorite running shoes brooks Maybe I give him a give him a chance. Alright, I'm gonna do these like reverse walk on an incline though, because I heard that's good for the for the knees. My knee didn't hurt that bad. Like in the beginning, it was just like kind of like, you know, there. And then went away. I think I like the shoes. I stopped after 30 minutes. So I'm gonna put the run right there. Today is Tuesday. I have my bike, I'm up here in LA and I was gonna go for a ride, but that just never happened. I don't know why. Probably because it's an early morning start thing and I've not been getting up early. I'm gonna try to get the one hour easy run in and do it outside. Light run, not sure how far. Now I said an hour this morning, but I'm just gonna see how my knee feels. I don't get it. What happened? It's so annoying, it's just my knee. I'll just be running and then it's just like this like dull and then it just goes like sharp pain, just like sharp. Two weeks off, I'm like, it's two weeks not enough. It's never gonna go away. Like, what is going on in there? There's nothing more frustrating than like it's like it's like almost like having someone tell you you can't do something for this guy. Yeah, that's kind of gonna try to keep going. I'm gonna try to just pump it out. You want 
what the hardest part is, is like, you're not, I'm not, it's not even a cardio thing, you know what I mean? I'm tired. It's fucking mean. Los Angeles, California. And uh, easy run. Knee feels good now. When I warm up, it feels okay. <sighs> that was a good run. Scale of one to ten. Um, I feel like a 10. Hey, these sh oh, hold it. Okay, we're back. <laughs> <laughs> this shoe, I should give it a review. I, I wasn't like a huge fan of Brooks for the longest time. I'm just being honest. I'm not saying it's an ugly shoe, but it, it's not like the most like appealing aesthetic shoe compared to like a Nike or an On or an Asics. But okay. the point is, that's not what matters. What matters is how comfortable I am. I'm actually really digging this shoe for easy runs. And I was just busting out some some fast intervals at six minute pace. Feeling good. This is a non-carbon plated shoe, just like normal foam. So it's a decent shoe, that, which, which leads me to say, I'm curious to know what their carbon race shoe is actually like, if this thing performs that well. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. I really like these shoes and I'm gonna continue to do my, my easy runs. In oh shit. What happened? I just ate the shit. A coffee I made. And I got, so, uh, let me show you this. Oh, ah, okay. Look at that. So what I did is I did rolled oats, turmeric, anti-inflammation. And then I did almond butt. Almond butter. Do you think I cooked that? I didn't. Talk about anti-inflammation, health, and wealth. Mmm. Oh my God, there's raisins in there too. And cranberries. That, oh my god, it's so good. So that was a whole run video, and I'm going on guess what? Another run today. So we're just things are on the up and up. Mm. What? Things are on the up and up. They are on the up and up. I know they are, and I can tell. You're so happy. Mmm. Um anything else?